Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to write a code to calculate uh, uh, quality factor of community. So uh, in this code, what I'm going to do, I'm going to calculate modularity, NMI, normalized mutual information, and ARI. So uh, Karate dataset uh, is being used in this code in GML format. And uh, for this demonstration purpose, I am using InfoMap Community Detection Algorithm. So, uh, in order to calculate NMI and ARI, you need to know the ground truth of community. Like for Karate dataset, what is the ground truth? So, I have collected this dataset. So, what you have to do, you have to create a list. So as we know in this data set there are 34 nodes and in this list what you have to do you have to represent every node with the community they belongs and community start from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on. So in ground truth of uh, Karate data set there are only two communities. So let's say this is the first node this node belongs to second community so we have written here 1. If a node belongs to first community we have written here zero so in this manner we have provided the information like a node belongs to which community so this uh, information you need to have now next thing uh, here when we have executed this info map community detection algorithm it will return partitions so in order to calculate modularity only this partition information will be sufficient okay now in order to execute or sorry calculate NMI we need to go for compare community we need to pass here partition now the thing is that we have uh, provided here membership and information Whereas this one return cluster like first cluster is having that many nodes and this is this. So what we will do we will convert this partition into membership. Okay and here we have passed GT and in method we will write NMI. And for ARI also we need to Right, same GT method. So let's print Q Let's execute this. Okay, so uh, the thing is that uh, here mm, the function is not for graph, so now it's perfect. So the modularity for InfoMap is 402 and NMI you can write 0.699 if you want to go for only 3 places after decimal and ARI is 70. So in this manner you can calculate Q, NMI and ARI and if you also want to go for accuracy in that case you can compare your party, partitions membership with this one. So if a node is perfectly uh, partitioned in that case you can count those nodes and you can calculate the percentage. Thank you very much for watching.